Hi guys, uh, welcome to my channel audio video me and uh, in this video I'm going to do the unboxing of uh, Google Chromecast audio and uh, I'm just going to do the setup of Google Chromecast audio. Uh, so basically what this device is, it's a wireless Wi-Fi uh, audio streamer or you could say it's a, a Wi-Fi uh, receiver. Uh, so uh, this can be plugged into your old amplifiers or new amplifiers or AVR audio video receivers or into any speaker that uh, has uh, uh, RCA input, 3.5 mm jack input or optical input or uh, obviously you can get different adapters off market to do the conversion. Uh, so I'm just going to start with the unboxing of this device and uh, there's a sticker basically I don't need the knife so I can just peel this off uh, it works on uh, 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz channel uh, the Wi-Fi standard that it supports are A, B, G, N and A, C the newest standard as well uh, so basically by investing in, the, in this device uh, you are basically covered in terms of Wi-Fi um, uh, at the end of the video I'll, I'll, I'll demonstrate or I'll, or I'll explain what's the difference between uh, the Bluetooth uh, uh, receiver, aux receiver and this one okay so as I open the box uh, I get this round shaped Google uh, Chromecast audio uh, which I believe is the same size as uh, Google Chromecast Gen 2 uh, the video version uh, so uh, this is the uh, 3.5 mm uh, aux output now they have provided this cable 3.5 mm uh, aux cable so let me just place this here uh, this is the USB power it requires 5 volts 1 ampere of power uh, obviously that can you can connect it to your laptop or any other source and uh, then this is the on and off switch okay what else is in the box the adapter okay So the way you connect it is, uh, I'll demonstrate on this speaker and this applies to all the devices you want to connect it to. Uh, so I'm just going to show the back side of the speaker. Let me zoom in. Okay. Uh, so on this particular speaker I've got uh, uh, unbalanced RCA TRS or XLR input uh, what I'm gonna do for this demonstration is I'm just gonna get a 3.5 mm to TRS quarter inch uh, jack adapter just gonna plug this in and uh, while you're plugging anything into your speakers or amplifier make sure the main uh, volume is down so just plug this in and uh, plug the Google Chromecast audio like this and obviously you need to provide it with power hopefully in near future uh, they can drive the power from this port and uh, okay so just gonna connect the power now there is a LED here that shows that it's switched on. Okay, so after switching on the device, uh, the LED would turn from amber to like uh, blinking white. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Once it gets to that stage, uh, open the Chromecast uh, app on your phone or on your tablet or on your iPod. Uh, I mean iPod, iPad or Apple devices and uh, just go to devices inside Chromecast app and then I can see Chromecast Audio 35 setup so I'm just gonna go with the setup and uh, let's set up okay there you go it has its default uh, factory name called 3508 probably that's the production number uh, okay okay it's 
doing something. I'll just zoom in a bit just to. Okay, so now it seems uh, we are about to play a sound to test your Chromecast audio. Okay. And let me increase the volume. And I didn't hear anything. Did you hear the sound through your speaker? No, I didn't hear it. Okay. Play sound again. Okay, now I heard the sound. Okay, I heard it. And uh, name your Chromecast. I'm just going to name it a V M E Audio. And uh, I, I don't want to enable guest mode or anything. Send Chromecast, use the Jetta, the crash report to Google. Don't want to send that. Or, and set me. Okay, so now it's asking me to put the uh, password. Uh, details for my Wi-Fi network which I'm gonna do now okay okay after putting the password it's just trying to configure it Okay guys, uh, uh, one thing uh, while playing uh, with the Chromecast audio, uh, I figured out not all the applications, uh, music uh, playback applications, they're compatible with it. Uh, so I think, I believe Google Play Music is compatible with it. And uh, uh, for some reason when I try to cast it uh, to uh, Chromecast audio, uh, it just gives me an error message stating that uh, to play the song upload it to play music from your computer uh, so i believe i need to uh, upload uh, my uh, playlist uh, to my google music uh, profile uh, i i can't as long if it's not registered or something like i'll find out about it uh, but my phone is hooked up with it uh, so this was the demonstration of android device i'm just gonna show you the setup on uh, apple devices uh, so what you do is you just download the Google Chromecast app on your Apple device go ahead open it and uh, once you open it just go to devices and uh, as long uh, your device appears uh, the Google Chromecast audio then you're ready to go uh, so for this demonstration I've downloaded uh, TuneIn Radio and uh, just gonna stream some music to the Chromecast hopefully something appears there you go I can see my device right here and uh, it should play shortly and let me increase the volume Okay guys, uh, during the setup I've uh, figured it out that uh, Chromecast uh, Audio, Google Chromecast Audio is not a standalone uh, uh, out of the box uh, audio receiver like if you get a Bluetooth uh, uh, aux receiver you can just uh, stream any music from Bluetooth uh, to that dongle and it's uh, widely available on Amazon or eBay uh, for 3-4 quid. Uh, but in terms of uh, Google uh, uh, Chromecast audio uh, it's uh, application specific uh, so what it is is like if you got any native app uh, like I've I've got this Honor 7 and the, the native app is not compatible with uh, uh, streaming the music to Google Chromecast uh, audio I need to upload all my music uh, to Google Play uh, which is a cloud-based uh, application so I upload all the music to Google Play and uh, then I can uh, play the music from any device uh, uh, regardless uh, Apple or Android uh, so uh, uh, which I'm not happy with uh, obviously uh, uh, if they are advertising it as an uh, uh, audio streamer uh, for your mobile devices then it should not be app specific uh, it's, uh, you should be able to just stream uh, any music from any device uh, 
uh, to your Google Chromecast uh, like you could do it on the Bluetooth dongle. Uh, final verdict is that uh, it's a good device. Uh, it's a good device, uh, but uh, I'm not happy that uh, you can't just uh, send any kind of uh, audio to this device. Uh, it needs to work inside specific applications. Uh, okay guys, hope you have uh, liked the video. If you do, uh, please click on the like icon and please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Bye.